girl read. It's a little early. I know it said seven, but we're starting at 10 minutes early to riff, get cozy, get comfortable, get all them technical buggies out. Uh, the technical buggies being me pulling up my chats. So this way, um, if you guys comment, I can see it because I would love to talk to you. What are your opinions? What are your feelings? How are you feeling? It's a Monday. How are you guys feeling on this Monday? Um, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, and I'll want to a little, a little overwhelmed, as one could imagine, because uh, it's Monday. Ugh. But today we are going to be playing Untitled Goose Game. We held a poll on our Instagram. It was between Untitled Goose Game and Hades, and it won just by like a few votes. So if you were hoping to see me play Hades, do not worry. I've been told that this game is actually fairly short. So I'm going to be messing around in here as a goose. Uh, I'm going to be trying to put my best uh, chaotic energy. I've heard this game is very chaotic. I haven't, I've never played it before. Um, I've heard some good things, heard great things. It's become a meme in and of itself. You know me. I love me some memes. Um, but yeah, we're just going to play, have fun. If you're watching post stream, hello from the past. Hope you're doing well. Uh, let's get going. We're streaming on Facebook. We're streaming on Twitch. We're streaming on YouTube. Uh, right now I got my Twitch and my YouTube, uh, Twitch and Facebook comments up. So this way, feel free to shoot a comment. Uh, shoot a hello. And I'm happy to talk to you. Let's see how well we can do this game. We're going to do another quick technical test. Uh, I'm going to do and see, let's see if we can hear it. Uh, you're going to hear some overlap. One sec. Um, yeah, it works. Um, one more test. D bear with me. Awesome. The one thing, I, my, my one fear is that no one's going to hear this sick music because I've heard that this music is really calming. All right. We're a couple minutes in. Uh, uh, I, I can't wait. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for this. Untitled Goose Game by Helt House, which is such a great, such a great name. All right, let's see. Let's begin. We're doing single player. Also, if you're out there and you want to be the second goose to my first goose, hit me up. I'm down to. I'm down for some multi goose action. Ooh, this is nice. Uh, I want to start with a red notebook, but that's just an. Well, it is Untitled Goose Game, so I think it's time for a little bit of anarchy. We're gonna save on number three. Your progress stays automatically. Oh, that's nice. Um, let's see. Oh! It's me! Oh! Oh, I'm so cute. Double click to run. I don't know what double clicking is because I'm using my keyboard. I don't have a elite gamer mouse, so. Oh. Back in run over here. All right, we don't have running down, but that's okay. Running is for chumps. And I am not a chump. Hold control. Ah! Wait, I think I can hold C for crouching. Ha ha! Oh, okay. What a cute little goose. See, now we're running into a problem here because I know I looked at the options before this because there's other things to do. Uh, all right, I'm going to do a Gamerson. I got to escape. Got to go my options because it's asking me to do a bunch of like things that I can't do. Adjust keyboard and mouse. Grab Z. Okay. You know, Z. Uh, stop telling me to, to do things. Uh, for mouse move up, down, right. Grab, run, run and shelf. So shift. Okay. Back. All right. Let's get back to the game. I want to get back to this game. We are just getting started. So let's let's test this. 
Oh, nothing can stop me now. I'm so fast. This is my boot now. Come on. Oh, you get the boot. You get the boot. What's this boot? Bend. Okay. Um, bend down to pick things off the ground. Shift to Z. Oh, okay. Let me pick up this. 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 Come on. I can bend down pressing C Z. Ah. That's nice. It's what a lovely home I have. It's a ball. I'm a goose that can play fetch. What a good goose I am. Taking this ball to town, baby. Not this ball, it's okay, ball. Oh, they're testing what I have learned already. All right, all right. I will say there's a bit of precision in this game that I wasn't expecting. Gosh, everyone's saying how much of a not good gamer I am. Oh my goodness. All right, we're gonna go forward. Come on, you silly goose. Oh, goodness, this is going to be embarrassing if I can't get past this screen. All right, here we go. I need to get the bottom one. Hold C and press Z. Okay, so we're going to try this again. C, V. Yes! Oh, man. Well, I broke the gate. Nice. Our first act of chaos. Come on, ball. Going to town. I don't know why I feel like I I feel obligated to take this ball with me. Hold X to spread my wings. Heck yeah, baby. Oh man, I don't want my ball to get wet though. Okay, ball. I don't want to lose you in town because I'm new to this game. So we're just gonna guard the house. I'll be back. Ugh, the ultimate test. Can I swim? Of course I can. I'm a goose. <gasps> Food! I'm hungry. I'm a hungry little goose. Can I eat? Oh, your sandwich is now dirty. Be free, Apple. Be free. This pocket square, however. Now this, this, I know. Wait, can I pick up the pocket square? Oh, man. Oh, man. But this bag is handsome. Oh, it's a picnic basket. Oh, my picnic basket now. Ah, officially mine. Oh, something inside, I see. I pulled it into the grass, which is a little too difficult for me. So we're just gonna swim this back across the lake.
Can I open it? Zach, come on, I could open it. Well, if that's not opening it, then nothing will. Ooh, press S to zoom in and zoom. Oh, we're in another thing. Come on, game. Be more intuitive and, and know about my needs. I can't zoom out that way. Let's see. Needs a volume language. Adjust keyboard and mouse. Zoom out. Like zoom out. If zoom in is S, yeah, zoom out A. All right, cool. Oh, I see a, a man looking for a watering canteen. All right. You get into the garden, get the groundskeeper wet, steal the groundskeeper's keys, make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat, rake in the lake, <laughs> have a picnic, bring pic bring to, bring to picnic blanket, sandwich, apple, pumpkin, carrot, jam, thermos, radio, basket. Okay. Gonna have to come get your mulch, old man. Oh man, he's a he's a Grumpy old user. Give me your keys. We need to, we've gotten to the garden. We need to get the ground. We've gone into the garden. Check. All right. Oh, he wants his shovel, does he? He wants to shovel with a handle. Don't mind me, sir. Don't mind me. Let me just get that for you. Damn it. I'm just, I'm just abusing this man. Oh. Hmm. Ooh, a pumpkin! They say I need that for my picnic. Thank you, sir, for your, uh... Where's the blanket is my question. Is this the blanket? The sandwich is still good. There you go. Or else you get that other half a sandwich. Crucial for my picnic. Yes! Who said you didn't like a good soggy triangle? I know I do. Okay, so back on task of what we're doing today. 
Get the groundskeeper wet. All right. Uh, still gonna... Rake in the lake. Have a picture. Come on. Well, where's the rake in the lake? Let's find a rake. Oh. <laughs> Hide in the bushes, he'll never see me. Never see it coming. Oh! Hello! Axolotl questions, don't party! So sorry, I didn't see you there. Pleasure, welcome to dropping in. To me, not knowing how to be a goose. But uh, I will try my best. Also, the fact that you say that I'm better than baseball, I, I appreciate it. It, said, it still says I'm playing Speeding for Ghosts. That is a, a problem that I will have to solve at some point, because I... Don't I even haven't I tried to fix that and I thought I had gotten it fixed, but um apparently not. Which I think that just speaks to me playing Untitled Goose Game a little bit. You know, stop this man break. I want No, it's my rake. You can't have it any Oh, I hate that you're tall. This is what it feels like to be a short person. Because it's how I feel. Alright, you want pots and you want your boots? This is actually a surprisingly difficult game so far, or I'm just not very good at this game. Um, to be fair, I just started playing. I have had no prior experience to being a goose before in my life. Uh, so what I do know is, you know what sucks? What's worse than having one boot? Having one boot that's wet. So go oh, fuck yourself, groundskeeper. Come over here and get your manky boot. Yes. You're going to have a wet boot, my guy. This is what we're going to do. Go over here. Because I don't know. If, if you guys have played the game and you have any awesome goose tips, uh, let me know. Because this is, this, is this is an experience. This is a time. Ha ha! Fuck your boot. Pardon my French. But um, I think his boot... I will kill, I will kill you. Oh. Can you let me back into your garden so I can terrorize you some more? Because um, that'd be really helpful. Gosh darn it. This man. Well, I guess it's helpful. He's picking up stuff. Let me get your key. Let me just... Do you mind if I borrow these keys real quick? All right, let's see. Well, what happens... Can I turn this on? That is the question. Oh, he finally noticed I took his pumpkin. What a dip. All right, we're gonna try to sneak up here. He'll smooth like. Oh. This man's awful. I don't like him either. I wonder what, no wonder why this goose hates everybody. This pumpkin. You can go make a pie for all I care. Bye. Ice <laughs> Hi. Oh, hey, don't be, don't be mean. I'm just, I'm just your friendly neighborhood goose. I'm just your friendly neighborhood goose. Oh yeah, where's your boot? Oh man, that's crazy. All right, let's see. Now, th this is the, so I do like the music of this game. That was something that was advertised to me as, as, as a good time, is that the music is good. And apparently it's royalty free, which is, which is nice for, for if anyone's wondering. Um, shoot, 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 nope, those are mine. God dang it. Okay. I wouldn't have thought, because I played Colonel Sanders, I Love You, Colonel Sanders, and that game was somehow a lot more relaxing than this one. Even though it is playing very relaxing music, 
Oh, there's a thermos that I need for my picnic. All right. I'm, I'm seeing all the pieces here. All the puzzle pieces are coming together. My Machiavellian goose mind is, is spinning and whirring, and I'm, I'm learning. I'm understanding. I'm understanding what it means to be a goose. Can I play with this? This is mine now. No, he really likes his shovel in a certain spot. So you know what we're going to do? I think I know what we're going to do to get this man, this, this mean old man wet. Ha! You are a wet man now. A, 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 look at how moist your pants are. What a silly moist man you are. Moist your Moistest man. Don't mind me. I'm just a very triumphant goose. Just gonna wreck your garden. Don't mind me. I'm just a just a humble goose. Hey, hey, why'd you do that? He's giving me the run around. He's pushing me. What a mean man. Scared. Spooked. Ah, oh, dang it. See, the next thing I'm going to do is throw that man's keys into the god darn lake. That's where those keys are going. Better be ready. Can you put that key back? You put that, put it back. Oh, okay, so he's scaring me off. That's the, I have to be a sneaky goose. No, no, continue. Put, in the flower, put the flower back. Put it down. Put it down. Thanks. Well, I stole them, so technically that counts. Um, so, fun fact, I'm not good at running yet in this game. Uh, how, the, how the F do I run? Shift. I run with shift. I knew this. All right, so this is what we're going to do. I'm going to take this man's flower because he doesn't deserve it. And go. You know what? Your carrots too. What a mean man. Let me just steal your keys. Let me just steal your home, your livelihood. I'm, I am somewhat satisfied that he keeps dropping it. Hey, put your flower back. You're being a very bad gardener. Put your flower back. What are you doing? Put your flower back, you dummy. I'm gonna call him Higgis. He doesn't have a name, but I'm gonna call him Higgis. As you can see, there is definitely a learning curve to this game. Okay. Higgis, Higgis, I, 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 I need you to, I need you to work with me, Higgis. Thanks, Higgis. Bye. Shoot, I'm bad at running. Oh no, I still haven't learned to running. Oh, I dropped the keys. Well, fine. I don't need your keys anyway. Make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat. Well, how do I do that? Well, you know, sir, it's a very sunny day. Oh.
Your water's your water's leaking, old man. You should really look into that. You should really look into that. You're the waste of water. We're in a drought, you know. You really shouldn't be such a such a wasteful fool, you know. Also, this rake is not up to standard. Like, don't mean me. I'm just a just a humble. I agree. I just. Also, I was gonna name the farmer Higgis, but honestly, if the goat, if this goose's name is Higgis, I love it. I'm gonna freaking, I don't, I don't give a flying hoot about this farmer. Hey, this is Higgis's rake now. This is actually the wonderful thing and the thing that I question. Like, this is gonna show some light about me. Ha ha! At your rake, Higgis rules this land now. This does have a very much like a like a England vibe, but I honestly think that this is the new king of the land. What else is on our to-do list? We need to have a picnic. Firstly, I'm assuming this is our our blanket. I'm assuming, or is there another blanket around here? Let's find out. We can we can zoom out. We've learned. Uh, that looks like a blanket to me. A very small blanket, though, all things considered. Uh, oh, there is an actual blanket. All right, that makes a lot more sense. All right, so we're going to pick up our apple. Can't have a picnic without a, without a blanket. Can't have it without an apple either. Question, what do you guys bring on picnics? Because to me, I'm like, I, you know, there's a certain... I had this like kind this weird sort of talk with my sister where like if I'm having a picnic on the beach, I expect there to be sand in my sandwich. I'm not saying it's something that like I want a lot of. Like if there's a ratio, it needs to be only like 10% sand. Like only 10%. If there's more than 10% sand, then that's just a sandwich, literally, and I don't want that. But I like that like when you bite, there's like that little bit of grit, like when they add like really big sea salt granules like on a sandwich. That's kind of where I'm at. Um, yeah, look at that. That's a nice, we're coming together with a nice picnic. We're coming together. All right, now we need a sandwich. Gotta have a sandwich. Sandwiches are the ultimate picnic food in my opinion, so. Yeah. The aesthetics in this game is simply marvelous. Oh. Kicked over my basket. That's fine. Listen, we're here for a chaotic time, not necessarily an orderly time. And <laughs> there's something stupid about a goose running with two legs. It only has two legs, but it, it looks dumb. But I love it. It's beautiful. All right, sandwich. Uh, you're gonna meet Apple. And you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna Marvin Gaye and get it on. When I come back, I better have an apple sandwich, if you know what I'm saying. Um, I mean, Dom, if I have a picnic and you bring sand to my picnic, I'm honestly going to be, like, weirdly excited about that. So now when the world opens up, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw a picnic. You're going to be invited. And I'm going to expect you to bring sand. And I don't know what we're going to do with it, but something good's going to come of it. I got you cool, little man. You should get that, by the way. Hey, 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 go get, focus on your water, you silly man. Focus on your, dang it, I want your radio. Well, I'm just trying to have a lovely picnic, and you're ruining it. Um, I need a pumpkin, I need carrot, and I need jam. All right, let's see. I need a carrot. I need a carrot. Now, carrots, to me, are honestly my favorite vegetable. Just putting that out there. In case anyone wants to get me a gift for Christmas, uh, a carrot would be cool. This one. I only need one. I'm not that picky. You have so many carrots, you don't need this one. Bye. 
Like, thanks, Don Party. I'm so freaking excited for this awesome picnic that I don't know who else is showing up, but like, hey, Cuculio, what is up? Um, we are playing Untitled Goose Game, and so far everyone's been watching me be not great at playing Untitled Goose Game. Also, we're planning a picnic. Um, Dom is bringing sand. Uh, what are you bringing? I'm gonna bring, uh, hopefully, the tombs. Or the radical bomb time. Hey, don't mind me. Go, go back to your business. I'm gonna steal your pumpkin. Thank you. Um, which, hey, if anyone can bring a goose to this, to this picnic, it doesn't have to be dead, it's preferably a live goose, then, then we're halfway there to recreating Untitled Goose Game. Um, doesn't matter what color. Also, if anyone knows, what is it between a goose and a swan? Because I think they're both pretty mean. Yeah, pumpkin picnic! I mean, yeah, listen, let's just recreate the Untitled Goose Game picnic. Sure. Give a follow. Give a like. Come, come to our goosey picnic, where we're gonna get we're gonna get loose. There's gonna be a goose. There's gonna be sand. There's gonna be a pumpkin, probably. Um, which, if you've ever played Legend of Zelda, everyone knows that every good meal that replenishes your heart, soul, and spirit is a pumpkin. Um, that's just the rules. I don't make video game rules. I just write shows, and they're very fun. Um, this is my trowel now. I'm sure there's something else I can do with it. I can see why they say this game is nothing but chaos, because I just did several things. Uh, I need jam, thermos, and a radio, and I need to have him wear his sun hat, which that is going to be a difficult chance for me. Um, but yeah, give us a follow to Coolio. I feel like I should give you the pitch on what we do here. If you are not familiar with Super Dating Simulator, uh, every Monday we have a good time. We essentially, well, we I play Untitled Goose Game. I have three other awesome producers who also um, we we play along with different other things. Uh, we have Sarah, who has been I think she just finished her run of Speed Dating for Ghosts, which is why it says that in, in the link below. Shout out to Sarah. Uh, we have Sam, who's playing a game that I actually don't know the title of, but it's it is very pro gamer. And then every month. We make up a satire satirical, um, go F yourself, Farmer John. Um, we have a satirical choose your own adventure show. That's what we do. Um, very fun stuff. Don't need this jam. You don't need this jam. You are an old man. You have gum dentures. You don't need this. Are you sketching me? Huh. <laughs> Ugh, anger. Now your jam's wet and you're dumb. You're a dumb man with wet jam. Well, fine. Fine. Go take your jam elsewhere, sir. Ugh. Uh, actually, this is probably a good time to check to see how my frame rates. I'm, I'm dropping frames. I'm dropping them. But that is okay. Not really, but we'll... We will figure it out in the future of what, what, what we will do about that. But we're out here kind of to do our best. That's sort of what I think this stream and what life is about. You know, I don't think I can pick up this pot. I think it is too heavy. I am the cause of the drought, is what I'm realizing in this game.
Yeah, this is okay. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to. I'm seeing there's a Rube Goldberg. I'm trying to to Sherlock Holmes it. You know, where he just kind of looks at things and he's like, Ah, yes, I can see Watson because of the ash under his fingernails. Clearly, he's a he's a former smoker. So all I need to do is is just make him smoke a cigar. And if I make him smoke a cigar, then then he'll die of cancer or something. That's a little too fucked up for Sherlock Holmes, but I feel like Sherlock has done some weird shit with Ash. Like that's like his big thing that he goes, he goes, I know Ash, and he yells about it. Um speaking of which, speaking of Ash and Sherlock, I would be very, very into the idea of no, you don't need this jam. Ah. Oh, what? See, I thought this like was so much deeper than it was. <laughs> but that's what I get for being a goose. Silly, silly goose. I knows very little about this world. It's like, what is, what? A goose? Let me into your garden, old man. Let me in. And I'm here to show you that you don't need material goods to be happy. That's the point of Untitled Goose Game, is to show that you don't need material goods to be happy. That's, that's the true point of Untitled Goose Game. Now the true question is, can I just get this hand? See if we can hide. I would love to hide all of his stuff just in the flower bushes and see if you can find them. That's that's supreme anarchy. The one thing that I find very fun to think about, because this game is making me revisit the ideas of my youth, which is if I was a ghost, what would be my like my thing? You know, there's ghosts that take your keys, there's ghosts that like, you know, hide your hide your stuff. So it's hard. Where is he? I don't even know where he is. I'm gonna run into him again. Oh, yep, there he is. That undo my progress putting the rake in the lake? No, if, if the rake's in the lake, the rake's in the lake. That's convenient. Um, but what would I do as a ghost, you, might, you would ask? Uh, great question. Uh, I would... I would write helpful reminders to people. I feel like that would be my ghost thing. My ghost thing would be like I would I would do like helpful things like I would leave notes to you and I'd be like hey, um, you remember you're visiting your aunt Sarah this weekend, so you know, don't forget that, or like stuff like that. Mainly because I don't know I don't think I'd want to be a nuisance in that respect, but at the same time I would totally do things that are just not helpful to you, like I think it was like a good one. Um, I, I would probably mix up your USB cords. I'm that ghost who would get your USB cords in a knot just because you need something to do. Not really, but I would need something to do because I'd be bored. Which, in summary, is why you need to leave out a spare phone and a Wi-Fi password. Every ghost in your house. At least that's what I would do. Um, not that I've ever done it before in my life, but that's the plan. Oh, he still can't find his boot. What a dummy. What a dumb man. Thanks for the thermos, man. I don't even know where you are. Oh, there he is. Here's my master plan. I have it. I think this is genius. What I'm going to do is you grab everything a person wants. It's I'm, I'm going to call it, I'm going to come up with strategies. I'm making a strategy guide for, for Untitled Goose Game, even though I have no idea what I'm doing. And the strategy gu guide is the devil's bargain. So here's how the devil's bargain works. You take everything, and I mean everything, and you put it in one spot that's far enough away from them. So in order for them to get everything they've ever wanted, they must give up one thing. 
And that one thing, the thermos. You're so dumb. Gullible, gullible man. Yeah, go find, find your single carrot and your flower. Go, 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 go. Go find them. I don't take this. Yeah, all you gotta do is you gotta sweeten the pot. You gotta sweeten the pot for the farmer. No, hey, you don't get everything. You're ruining the... Ugh. All right. This game is... Is is it is it oh I forgot that I can honk and that honestly just made me a little feel a little bit better about my my grand master plan not working. Um Well that's what you gotta do. Yeah, where's your flower? Go find it. Uh, see the, the problem with my master plan. Wait, I'm a genius. What you do is firstly Secondly. Oh, yeah. Gosh darn it. Fine, take your thermos back. You're just gonna put it back to where it belongs anyway. He still hasn't found his flower, which I think is pretty funny. You know what would be very funny? I don't know how to do this, but I, I and I've and I've recently learned I can I'm not allowed to do this. But playing Doom music while playing Untitled Goose Game, I feel like it'd be the best matchup ever. Rip and tear until the chaos is done. You know that sort of thing. Um, for radio, that's the last thing I need. This game really is about just creating chaos and then just... I got this. This is my doom music. No, Goose, no! I must get my radio to my picnic! Does it count? Did I make it? Yes! Woo! Yeah, this is better than this is better than baseball. Oh my god! <laughs> he just gives up! He just gives up! After I get to the blanket, I'm a home free. I'm safe, baby, with my picnic. Yes. Now what are you doing, old man? I'm trying to figure out how to make you wear your sun hat. Let's follow this guy. Hey. Make the groundskeeper hammer his thumb. That's funny. All right. Well, there's the hammer. I think to make him wear his sun hat, we need to make him get off his old hat. Make him get off his old hat. Gotta make his hat unusable. Where is this guy? Where is where is old farmer? Taking his radio back, I see. That's fine. Let's go back to work, Mr. Don't mind me, I'm just flapping my wings like any good goose would. Oh, you naughty, naughty farmer. You have it coming. 
Ja. Mhm. 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 All right. Two. Ah, fuck your side, old man. I wonder if that sign is supposed to actually work in some capacity. All right, let's see. Here he goes. And a one, and two, and three, and ha ha! Oh ho, goose on the town! You know, this old man is not trying to have a community garden, Dom. He's having a selfish garden. Where are the people for the community garden? There's no one there. He just wants to kick me out, and that's rude. This garden should be for everyone, and that's including geese. And he's trying to be, look at this. Look at this anti-goose paraphernalia. Rude. I will not stand for it. I am the best goose. I'm just trying to have myself a nice time. He, he doesn't even treat his radio right. Look at how bad he's treating his radio. What a, what a mean, horrid old man. Mean, mean man. Of course, then again, I'm also a very terrible goose, so he probably is trying to, trying to do something good for the children. You know. I'm just going to run through his cabbages, make... Whoa! Is that a secret passage? <gasps> I think it is. All right, let's see. Secret tunnel, secret tunnel through the mountains. Secret, 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 secret tunnel. Well, that's pretty cool. It means this old man, no matter how hard he tries, can never keep me out. All right, I think I have an idea to get his hat. I think I have an idea. Here's what we're gonna do. Gotta get his attention. Then we wait in hiding. I'm the best goose. I'm the best goose that could ever goose. People are like, oh, I've never seen such a good goose before. And I'm like, of course you haven't, because I am le best goose. I mean, I'm also an impatient goose. Where's this old man? Oh, he's going to go put his cabbage back. That's not how cabbages work, you silly old man. Oh, see, I helped him. I helped him realize that that's where his his cabbages are, are time to time to harvest cabbages. How do I get him to wear his sun hat? That's that's the true question. That'll be my white whale of this game. The last thing I'll ever do is make that man wear his sun hat. And now I've gotten his horrible anti goose paraphernalia out of the way, for I am truly an awful goose. Now it is time for me to go to town. Do I have any new tasks in town? Break the broom, tap the boy in the phone booth, trap him. Okay, that makes more sense. Make the boy wear wrong glasses, make someone buy back their own stuff, get on TV, go shopping, put in basket, toothbrush, loo paper, 
Also, we are in Britain. Hairbrush, tinned food, cleaner, fruit, and veg. All right. Well, we already had fruit and veg, but okay. We'll trap a boy. We'll, well, let's go find this this said boy. Oh, a ball. This could be a great person for my sock, my, my ball. Come back here. Come back here. How dare you defy me, ball? You truly are the, the bad guy of the game. Hello, child. That really wasn't that hard, now was it? Sir, you wouldn't believe this. I'm trapped inside by this goose. I ran here of my own accord, but I swear to God, I can never handle it. Hello, ma'am. Oh, what? Well, oh, thank you for letting me into your store. What's this? I'm on TV! Haha, <laughs> I'm the best goose! Look at me go! Hey, hey. Well, fine. This is a fun play to have. Ooh, this is nice. It's mine now. I'm gonna buy it and everything. Wow, how dare you be so rude to me? I am a paying customer, ma'am. I've never been treated this unfairly in an establishment, I'll be honest with you. Like. This is, this is, this is, this is tomfoolery and chicanery. Utter barbarism. Utter barbarism, I say. Oh, someone put I was gonna buy that plane. Thank you. She's trying to sweep me out. I refuse to be swept out of my, out of this establishment, ma'am. You kicked your own orange. What a terrible old woman. That's time to that's time to break this broom. I will refuse to let go. Ha ha! I've broken it! You are not but crazy now. You know, I know exactly where this is going. Some place where you can't abuse it anymore. This music is nice. Like, even though there's just chaos, it's it's still kind of pleasant chaos. Cute little goose. That's what I have to say about this. What a cute little goose. All right, let's see. We still need to go shopping. 
Your broom's broken, old woman. You have no broom. You have no power over me. What? The stick still has power? F your stick. I honk at you and your your meanness. Very mean. Very rude to goose. Yes, run away, child. See, my hope is that that means he has to buy the plane now. That's my hope. Let's see. Let's see if it. Let's see if it works. Yes! Yes! Oh my goodness! This is this is weirdly this is weirdly triumphant moments for me. Um, like in the weird in the grand scheme of things, I'm not playing a Fortnite. I'm not playing Call of Duty. I just get weirdly jubilant about. I'm just, I'm just looking at my basket, lady. Jeez. Aha! Successful! One fruit! I think that's a fruit. It looks like an orange. Yes, little boy. Go buy your plane back. Now, this is something, as, as most people know, I'm a big avid fan of playing Dungeons and Dragons. Now, but the one thing I've never seen is someone play Higgis, who I've affectionately called him. Unless you can think of a better name for this naughty, naughty goose. Um... Speaking of being a naughty goose, how am I coming in on you guys over there? Am I, am I coming in good? Am I looking good? Am I looking crisp? Am I looking clean? Um, Because simple and clean is the way that you're making me feel tonight. Because when you walk away, you won't hear me say... Heh! <laughs> Your broom can't stand up no more. Thank you for this leak. I shall I shall buy it and take it home with me. Yes. All right. Does that count? Yes. We need tinned food. We need a hairbrush. We need some cleaner. This is cleaner, right? I'd say this counts. Hey, why did you eat the orange? That's rude. Fine, I didn't want it anyway. I didn't want your orange. And on the ground, too, anyway. Does this boy still not been able to find his freaking plane? I know the second thing I must do to this boy. He cannot find his glasses. Uh. 
all right, I gave you the glasses. Those are yours now. You can sell them. You're welcome. I'm your best little goose friend. I don't pay for things with goods and services, but I do pay for them in money. What is so loud? That still counts. Oh my, it doesn't count when she takes it out of my basket. That's dumb. Well, I know what I must do. I have to make this 10 times harder for me now. You can see we've, this is the uh, second level area. That's pretty crispy. Got to get some nice crispy, some crispy stuff. So we got to move this basket somewhere that this lady can't have a problem with me, even though I just turned it upside down. How the frick did I do that? How the frick did I do that? I'm such a talented little goose. Well, the question is, when can I? Oh, thank you. Oh, it, like crispy as in like, as in like bad or crispy as in like good? Wait, crispy as in... Crispin, I apologize. I feel like I'm functioning on only two brain cells this evening. And uh, one is named Haggis. And Haggis is in a video game, so. I'm assuming crispy means crisp, like crisp and clean. That's my hope, my dream. I need someone with hands to help me? Cause this is this is not working. Yes! Ah, oh, I need no one's help. I am the best goose ever. But I bet if we take this on the other side of the bench, maybe this woman won't care. It does make things a little harder for me. But. I, I, once we get it home free, it'll be, it won't be a problem. Oh, this child. Need my loo paper. Yes, success. This poor child, no one is gonna help him. She's like, where's the new paper? And I'm like, you'll never know. I'm gonna steal that broom handle. I'm gonna steal it, I'm gonna take it all the way to the lake. That's what I'm gonna do. Don't mind me. Go about your business. Go about your business, ma'am. Her little nod and satisfaction is what cracks me up. Crispy like a chip. Oh, that means it snaps. It means I'm crunchy. Crunchy's not good. That's no good at all. Well, the good news is uh, I will be in my normal setup uh, later because right now I'm actually off base. Normally I'm in the I'm in the Los Angeles base, Los Angeles place. It's my Los Angeles face. But uh, but now I'm actually in a, a place called Saint Diego. Hey farmer, I need you to hold on to this for me. Don't question. Just just hold it for me. Just say you're holding it for a friend if anyone asks. Thanks. Thanks, Farmer John. You're a peach. You need to put on your sun hat every once in a while. Thought I'd put that out there, you know. But now that we have, you know what? Let's just, you know, that's fine. A wet broom is good. She has not taken my loo paper, which is good. This boy is still being dumb, which is fine. Can I take this? Ha! Yes, wonder where your broom is. Or it has abandoned you. You know, I actually don't cook with leeks very often, but uh, I feel like this goose is about to. No, 
need to get in the basket. I can't officially go shopping if I don't have it in the basket. The lower. Yes. Okay, cool. Dang it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's hard being a goose. This is one thing I'm learning today. It's hard being a goose. People should hate with brooms. People are, are just mean. I mean, I get it, though. I get it. Darn it, Leek. You had one job. Hooray! Okay, cool. Um, Let's see. What else are we doing? What else are we doing here today? We need a fruit. We need a balanced diet as a goose. We need a fruit. And there we go. So now if we drop the tomato, she's like, oh no, where's my tomato? Where's my, where, where would it be? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Well, the, the secret want, the gold is the orange. Yes, she'll never see it coming. Unless if I walk directly into her while she's getting the tomato. Wait, haha, she isn't, hasn't suspected a thing. This orange is mine now. Now the biggest problem into the, damn, damn it, no. Okay, here's the thing. We're gonna put this loot paper over here, and then we're gonna we're just gonna get everything else. And we'll put the loot paper in last. Hooray! All right. Check my grocery list. I need a toothbrush, hairbrush, and food cleaner. All right. So let's get some tin food, which looks like that's tin food. All according to plan. I am sorry to everyone for the crispiness of my of my stream. I'm hoping at least I'm coming out decently. I'm looking over here because you guys are over here for me, and I'm over here for me. Um, yeah, I'm kind of watching the playback, and it is a little a little clippy. Which is uh, not very good. I mean, I'm smooth. The game is just clippy. Which talk about a interesting conundrum. That I'll probably have to talk to some of my cool streamer friends. Um, Axolotl questions is actually a really cool guy. I'm pretty sure he may or may not be in the audience right now. Uh, and if you haven't watched his stuff, honestly, give him a watch. He's very talented. I enjoy watching his streams. Um, I missed today's, but today's they were doing a, a Nuzlocke of Pokemon Red, which. Uh, Freaking awesome. Uh, Sunday, which was yesterday, he did Risk of Rain, which is a game I've never seen before. Never seen Risk of Rain, never played it, never never knew a thing about it. And apparently that was like, it It actually opened my eyes a little bit to what was going on. And like, what's going on in the game community? I call myself a gamer, but, uh, but where are the games that I know and love? I love that she runs over here for her broom every time. It's like, you're not going to remember that it's gone now. Listen, ma'am, I have a date tonight, and I need this brush. You don't understand. I need it. I need it so much. Oof. I just have a mighty need for the brush. And you're just being really mean.
Are you clean or a toothbrush? So I think I need to give this kid back his glasses or something, or maybe I just give him the wrong glasses and the lady finds out. Well, I made him wear the wrong glasses, so that's a win. That's a win. I forgot that that was even a thing I had to do. Is that woman going to realize that he stole? Man, you're not good at this. Toothbrush. Ma'am, do you sell toothbrushes here? You have shirts. You have shirts. You have socks. I don't think toothbrushes, which is a uh, damn shame. Perhaps I'll go to the next store, ma'am. Have a, have a nice day. Your service has been awful. You'll be receiving a Yelp review from me. Ooh, some cleaner! I have such a clean house. Wait, what? Awful woman. She that's my stuff. Fine, I'll come back for it later. You're a horrible woman. Not letting me do sh do business here. I gave you a plane and I gave you some glasses. I mean, I stole some glasses too, but still. What a, what a rude woman. I feel like a toothbrush is going to be in this trash can. Oh, I'm a genius. I know sometimes I'm not the brightest bulb in the box, but today, today I'm a genius. But this one better not have any problem with me taking this mangy toothbrush. I have a bill, so it needs to be a little frayed, you know? It needs to be a little messed up for a goose of my physique. That's the one thing that I that that I am not the best at in this game. I need my toothbrush. You know, fine. We'll take this actually. It's heavy because of all the items we've purchased. No, go away. Go away. This is mine. Go away. I know what I'll do. I know what I'll do. I'll put it in the I'll put it in the booth. Phone booth. Also, I'm gonna say that this goose has the strongest neck known to man.
I've now trapped myself. Well, this is this is the time. You're no man of police. Don't fear them at all. <sighs> and then I get chased out. Well, this is this is interesting. I think I think I definitely need to figure out this creepy problem because that little kid is whack. Thank you, Dom. He's he's a little coward boy. He's a little pasty coward boy, and we can all agree. Also, what should his name be? I'm thinking I'm gonna name him like Quan or something. Something that's like Quizzle. His name's Q. His name's something with the letter Q. Also, he has like he has some going on with him. You're wearing the wrong glasses, my guy. There we go. Well, yeah, go find your glasses, you dumb, dumb child. All right. So far, my least favorite human in this game is that shop owner woman. And I feel like if there's not a community that talks about their least favorite people in Untitled Goose Game, there should be. Um, so far, we've met small child who is a whack little baby, a farmer, and this shop owner woman who has been very rude to me. I'm gonna ruin everything. I'm gonna ruin all your stuff. <sighs> I cer there certainly is come to this game, but kind of once you get into it, it's a little therapeutic, actually. And I'm kind of just walking around here. I'm just having a good time. Let's see what other... I've already done that. At least I make him wear his hat. Controls. We need to make someone buy back their own stuff, which the boy is so stupid. Um, that's what it likes to be a goose. You just think that, like, everyone is just so dumb. I just want this boy to realize that I've stolen his items. I just want them to realize this. That's all I want. If I could do anything tonight, it'd make a boy realize that I've stolen his items. His items are now belong to us. Um, but I feel like he'll never know. Unless... And what we need to do is something called sports. Apparently a phenomenon that human beings play. And what they do is they just they just dribble balls into places, which as a goose, I'm not amazing at sports. Clearly, I'm not amazing at sports. What do you do? So close. I am so close. So close. 
So close. Come on. Come on. All. Most. There. Yes. This is your ball now, woman. Yours now. You can have it. Bye. Yes, take the ball. Put a press sticker on it. Sell it. Wow, you're bad at this. What'd you do with the ball? Regina's into the shop, and then he will realize his plane is there, and his ball. Really? Yeah, go in, go in. Go into the shop. Notice that you're playing and your glasses are there. Go. You have to buy it now. Yes, purchase your plane. Oh, 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 oh my god. I got too excited and I apologize for that. Oh god. Whew. We did it though. Um, hmm. On that chaotic note, this might be the best time to end this stream as I'm being scared off by a child. He must also go back. Actually, he has to go buy it back and we have to go back and buy his ball. Let's go, let's go see how that how that pans out. That's going to be hilarious. Can he even find his ball? Let's see. Where's my ball? Found it. Does he have to buy it? Does he have to buy it? No, he can just leave with it. That's that's fine. That's fine. No goose. What a what a horrible thing to say. Trap the shopkeeper in the garage. Don't mind if it be. Then shopping will be so much easier. We're gonna have to do a little something also we also call the devil gambit. Come on, you can find it. You can do it. Go find your chalk. Go find it. Go find your chalk. All right, yeah, you can find your carrot too, but go find your chalk. Go find it. No, don't nod satis you know what she you know what what will be the surefire way to get her to go in go in there. Is that is that gun? I need it. Alright, she's putting prices on things. Put it down.
You just need to look, woman. You just need to look in your garage. Look, it's in there. Oh, it's not. It's not something. All right, fine. I'm gonna freaking get it. Just... Back to the old, old fashioned, old, uh, old fashioned way. Yes, your carrots are missing, old woman. Now what? Yes, 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 yes. Go get the leak. Go get it. She's going to pick up one at a time, isn't she? Jeez, okay. Yeah, go get the other one. Yes. Yes. Yes, go get the carrot. Get it. Go get it. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Go put your carrot in the basket. There's more in there. What? What? Who would have thought that was going to be a thing? Bye. Bye. Mm. Now I can do my shopping in peace. Uh-huh. Oh. Well. That was disappointing. But on that fun and cherished note, uh, hopefully next time we'll be a little less crispy on the on the video and we'll be able to figure out how to put sun hats on people. We'll be able to figure out other things. Um, man, she's just being mean to me. What a mean woman. Uh, that being said, we'll let her get her stuff. Uh, thanks so much for tuning in, guys. Thanks so much for like for chatting with us. Next week, I believe it is Sam who will be taking away with a, si a dating sim of video game proportions. Uh, we're going to have our next show next month. Uh, tune in. We'll let you know what the theme is. We'll let you know who the writer is. We'll let you know what the cast is. We'll let you know what all the saucy stuff is. Uh, have a wonderful night. And uh, remember, love, video games, and anime are super duper real.